Following her is innocent. Uh, I'm sorry. Innocent and Optis. They're here with me now. We're going to share our time together. Okay, let's 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 start a new protocol here because I need to be clear. Okay, if you if if there is something that needs to be changed in regards to how things are done, with how the board is doing it, it needs to be cleared before the before the board's meeting. Our, my opinion is our young people are capable of speaking for themselves. Okay, now if you want to conduct something other than a conference, uh, uh, to have a conversation with them, that needs to be cleared with the board president and the executive board before it happens at a board meeting. So this, this is your notice. I will allow it to happen this last time. But if you're going to bring students before us, I expect for them to stand up, present themselves, and represent themselves. I do not expect. They are. For, they are representing themselves. Then let them speak without you coerce, without you involvement. Do you understand what I'm saying? We have children that come and speak all the time. Excuse me, I'm talking. We have children that come all the time. And they stand up and they present their three minutes without anyone intervening with it. And that's what I expect from our young people. If you are training them to be leaders, that is what we expect. Three minutes that they can speak on their own. Okay? I agree with all due respect. The, these students are very much involved in this message that they want to bring to the board and to the community tonight. They would like to bring their message through art and artistic practice and they're going to be acting out a scene and okay. we'll be sharing the time so it's okay. not going to so in the future when you have something other than a direct conference that someone who wants to present directly to the board we have staff in our office and staff that can accommodate you we want to hear our young people we want to hear our young people and we want them to express themselves Okay, but, yes, we, we, but I have never seen a meeting in this city where someone has come and changed the protocol and procedure without clearing it before with, with, with the body. Okay, so that means that we want to hear what they say. We're going to allow you this time, but if you're going to present them in the future, they are to present themselves. Okay, is the board in agreement with that? Anyone have a problem with that? I would love to have a okay, further you. conversation about that because I'm not sure if that's fair, but... What's well, not fair about it? I don't want to argue about it right now. I would love for... Well, we can talk offline about it. Absolutely. Okay, Absolutely. When, when, when young people come before the board, they are well capable of presenting themselves in any fashion that they choose to for three minutes or more. Thank you. You're welcome. Any fashion that they choose to. Three minutes, everyone. My name is Deanna Amber. And I am a community health worker, as are these students, Innocent and Opti. Today, we want to bring a message through art and artistic practice. We have Innocent playing a student, and we have Opti playing a security guard. This is a typical day in the life of a student. Why are you going through my book bag like that where everybody can see everything? I have to check it. This is school policy.
So who can I talk to? Who can I talk to? Use your late pass. Go to the office. You are not suspended. They will call your parents. Don't be late. And sing. Thank you. And thank you for watching. We provide students support having experiences like this in school on a regular basis.